Do you remember graphene, the wonder material that shook the world in 2012? Yep, 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 yep. The OG members of this channel will remember we had a video about it. So, what happened to graphene? There isn't any talk about it in the news or anywhere else. Before we talk more about graphene, don't worry boys. You don't have to watch the old video. Let me give a quick recap. Graphene is a single layer of carbon atoms tightly bonded in an hexagonal honeycomb lattice. The closer you look, the less you see. So, let's not go even more closer by the way. Its unique properties are that it can conduct electricity better than silver and conduct heat better than diamond and it's stronger than steel. So it can be used to make I'm gonna fly that tank. <laughs> nope, you can't make flying tanks with it, but more like an flexible electronic circuit, strong composite materials, and better energy storing devices. Maximum effort. That's a quick recap. The scientists at Rice University used high energy pulse of electricity to turn trash into graphene. Trash is kept between those two electrodes and it with a short electric pulse of about 200 volts just for 10 milliseconds. That converts trash into very useful graphene. The university professor expected to make a ton of graphene with just under dollars of electric bill. Compare that to two hundred thousand dollars for a ton of graphene right now hey, we're going shopping so problem one solved but the main reason companies find it hard to bring graphene products to the market is that it's hard to find a product lineup and convince its application would be better if we added graphene into them just like how evs were considered to be very weak before tesla showed their roadster and model s which changed the whole car industry forever. Anyways, let's come back to the topic. So you get my point, right? Is that sarcasm? Was it? Mm -hmm. While writing the script, I found a company called Real Graphene, which makes power banks using batteries made from graphene. Disclaimer, we aren't sponsored by the company to mention their name. There is a company that makes flexible wearable electronics using graphene made circuits that can be washed. You gotta be yes, you heard me right. You can wash them. Take notes, Apple. Oh my god. As I told you in an earlier video, 2020 is a year that's going to have a lot of changes to the society. See you soon. Bye.